Hello everyone. Welcome to Inner Peace Night Time. Have you have you been practicing meditation regularly? Once again, starting our meditation during the weekday. And before we are gonna go to that part, allow me to greet those who are joining us at the moment. Currently, I'm quite early. And according to the broadcasting time, of course, that's the not usual. Therefore, there are quite a few people joining, but I hope they are coming later on. But as because, just gonna continue with that program then. Let's see who is joining us at the moment. Hello, Miss Kathleen. You are the first one today. Congratulations. Miss Yumi has been traveling to Japan, so I don't think she will be with us uh, for quite some time, but she should be back in three weeks, so hopefully in two more weeks she will come back. So that's, uh, we're just gonna be on our own for now. Uh, Mr. Martin, thanks for joining. You quite, did you have your dinner yet? <laughs> well, I think you, I hope so. So you can, you know, have a full stomach meditating. All right, so tonight tip that I like to share with you is make your life filled with happiness. Hmm. What would that be? What does our master mention? Why, or why is it so important? Let's take a look. <clears throat> and for those who are new, please don't be shy. You may leave the comment telling us where you're from so we can get to know each other. And in the peace of the night, don't September 23rd. Well, before we get to that part, always selling my stuff. Yes. <laughs> Great teaching monk. Good Q&A is our Facebook page in case if you are new and would like to continue with our meditation community. Don't forget to follow, like, and if you are enjoy, don't forget to share too. If you like, if you enjoy meditation, like. If you like to come back again, follow on our page okay all right if you are unable to join our live you can also watch us on youtube don't forget to subscribe like and share so we can get a notification of our live update video whenever they are broadcasting and uploading and the name is great teaching monk of the same name in case if you're wondering when is my schedule to live regularly well here is my schedule Monday at this time 8.30 as well as Wednesday nighttime meditation only, no, not much wisdom to share. But on Sunday a little bit earlier at 8 p.m. where you can enjoy meditation and learning wisdom that I like to share with you weekly on every Sunday. However, on Saturday these are variety of teaching monk available on Zoom. At the Zoom ID code is 14853306720, passcode is 072, and it is free of charge, of course. So you enjoy meditating with many teaching monks aside from myself. And I joining them rarely, maybe once a month, maybe every two months, depend on my availability, availability. But all in all, hope you can make it on Saturday as well. All right, let's go to our tip of the night. Make your life filled with happiness, purity, and peace throughout the day. That's, this is our topic. What he meant by this. Let me finish the sentence then. Make your life filled with happiness, purity, and peace throughout the day. The space in our heart should only contain happiness and purity. Anything that disturbs our peace or purity, simply shoo, it away and close it off. That's Yes, everyone. If you are experiencing something bad, something, you know, that you are feeling that it could disturb your inner peace or happiness, it is not good to keep it. But sometimes we tend to keep it, isn't it? It's kind of like we are like a monkey that got trapped. Well, you know, the ancient people, when they tried to, to cut a monkey, to catch a monkey, they put a simple tap, just only one banana and a box. What they do is they put a banana inside and then the monkey would go in there put, and put its hand inside the box. And once it grabs on the banana, it won't let go. And that's that causing it to be caught by a hunter. Likewise to our mind, when it is struck on something, it won't let go. And when it won't let go, it seems to cause a trouble than we have already have. 
and when it is like that, does we continue to suffer until we let go? Same thing like the tip that our master share. Instead of let those things disturb our peace, let the space of our heart fill with joy and happiness as well as purity. Only then you will not find yourself be disturbed by these impurity or negativity because they are like unwanted guests. Thus, when you practice meditation, always maintain feel Fill your mind with happiness and purity. And this will make you be happy and be with inner peace throughout the whole day. Hopefully this could be benefit, but some may say, oh yeah, it's easier said than done. Well, the thing is, if you never try, practice first. Well, first, second time, third time, fourth time, it might be quite difficult. But the more you get used, you will find yourself a trick and tip that can help you overcome and let go of this faster than usual on the first time. So keep practicing. All right. The thing is, I'm still not get my life fixed, so I'm still red. All right. So I'm not sick or anything. Just you know. <laughs> anyway, still, <clears throat> I'm not by the uh, spotlight. Looking for one. It's quite costly. It's about forty pound. <laughs> Need two of them though. Anyway, so. <clears throat> It need to be, you know, fixed, but hopefully you should make do for now. Anyway, so if you ask all set, let for, don't forget to check yourself three things. Number one, your mobile phone, make sure that it is in silent so that way it won't disturb your inner peace. Number two, toilet. You don't want to go to toilet during meditation, trust me. And number three, make sure that the room you are meditating with everyone here are peaceful, suitable for your meditation and you're all set. Ah, we got some more people coming. Hopefully... Uh, anyone else, you can leave the comment if I don't greet you at the time. Please take note that I'm still meditating. I will do that after the meditation. Miss Han, all right. Suit my schedule better now. Okay, good. Then I hope I can see you more often online then. All right, Miss Han. Okay, then let's us continue with our inner peace if everyone is all set. Don't forget to like too, okay? All right. <coughs> now that there is... <clears throat> now that it is time for our inner peace so let's begin our meditation everyone let's start by finding yourself sitting in the most comfortable position for your meditation scan your whole body check and see whether there is any tension on your body. Then gently close your eyes, feeling as if you are about to take a rest. And relax every single part starting from the top of your head relax down to forehead eyebrows and eyelids then make your face Feeling soft. Continue down to the neck and shoulder. Adjusting your back, your body properly. And relax both of your arms. Forearms. All the way to the tips of your fingers. Continue to relax further down from your abdomen down to your waist, legs and knees. All the way to the tips of your toes. Now 
making sure that your cell, your body is properly adjusted. When you find in yourself the balance, you would feel content or enjoy sitting in this position without further adjustment. Feeling like yourself is transparent or blended in with the atmosphere inside the room where you are meditating. Once you are done, continue on to adjust the mind. Put down all the things aside for the time being and imagine of yourself sitting somewhere where there's nothing or no one to disturb or bother you. A place where you can be yourself with the comfort feeling, no more worry or concern about people, animals, or any matters. Feeling free and enjoy this light and refreshed feeling. allow your mind coming back to yourself softly like a feather that's moving down allow the mind coming back gently rest inside yourself around your abdomen the most balancing point inside or anywhere that you feel just right to continue. Once the mind inside, maintain it within by observe using your feeling. Observe that it's there, the mind. Don't let it wander outside. Let yourself, both body and mind, take a rest. But should the mind begin to wander? Allow it to come back at any time by lightly imagine a star let the star shine within let it stay with the mind inside where you feel most comfortable whether it's on the abdomen inside or any point. Start with the light and comfort feeling to continue. No need to force or rush the mind to stop thinking. Let it be. Let it come and let it go without following the thought. It is just an unwanted guest. Or you may try to recite the mantra at your own pace in your mind. 
to free the mind from the thought should they arise. You may use your own mantra or the following one. Samma Arahang <coughs> Samma Arahang Samma Arahang Continue reciting mantra in the mind until there are no more thoughts. And let our mind stay while maintain the relaxation throughout our meditation. Let us continue on in silence until the appropriate time. May everyone attain inner peace in this session.
thiền đa mai thiền sa yo sao Master mind gradually come to a standstill within. Joy, inner peace would arise, fill into the mind, open up our mind to our love and kindness inside. So sharing this feeling that you discover with everyone that you love, starting from yourself to your family and friends, wishing them all to be happy. Free from all kinds of danger and suffering. May all the people love one another, just like their own family member. Continue. Spread loving kindness inside. Let's use our remaining time. Spread loving kindness.
Kadipra. Slowly breathing out and maintain your focus, your mind inside yourself. So tonight, you can be with inner peace. Sapaputta Nupavena, Sapatama Nupavena, Sapasanka Nupavena, Satta Soti, Pawantute. May you all be with inner peace. Welcome back, everyone. How have you been doing? Are you still meditating? Well, if you enjoy it, don't forget to share your meditation experience with us. For those who are regular, go ahead and leave the comment. For those who are new, you may leave the comment as follow. If you are experiencing relaxation, leave the comment as one. But if you feel time fly by fast or feeling like your body is light or disappear, leave the comment as two. But if you experience joy, happiness, or even brightness inside, leave the comment as three. Anything else that I didn't mention, leave the comment as four. I'll get back to you when I see your comment. While we are waiting for everyone, remember, when you practice meditation, everyone, you cannot rush. Sometimes people complain to me that whenever they meditate, a lot of thoughts coming in. Which is, please, understand that it's common. Everyone has that. And it's nothing wrong. But if you use that as an excuse not to meditate or don't want to meditate, that would be a big uh, hindrance and big obstacle for you. Because having such a thought like that, we have option. That is, don't pay attention. Most of us, when we are having this kind of trouble, thoughts coming in whenever you close your eyes, and you feel that you cannot do it because you choose to follow and let it bother you. Kind of like when you are sit in a room with there is a dog, keep barking. If you don't pay attention or don't care about it, it don't really disturb, isn't it? But if we pay attention and try to stop it, it's just going to be more and more louder and louder same thing if the thought come just wait wait for it to end and one is end that's all because we have choice and you can also do that but if don't you don't give yourself a chance you would never overcome it so keep practicing it's nothing wrong and it's nothing bad that you have such thought it's common but how you handle it, that's another matter. Don't let it become obstacle or hindrance for you to continue or quit your meditation. Oh, we got some people caring now why we, why we are, you know, discussing about thought. Mr. Martin 1, Mr. Hero 1, Miss Kathleen 2, and Han, Miss Han 3. Wow. We got all the number. <laughs> that's good. Because when you practice correctly, whether it's a long day or not, the thing is, What's in your mind on that day? If you meditate, is let's say you fi finally calm down and find peace, what's in that day we begin to let go and fade away? And the next day your mind is now is clear, ready for what's coming next. Then you meditate again, it will be gone and ready for the next day after. But if you don't, like today, you have a long, long day but you don't meditate, you go to bed. No problem, nothing wrong. But the next day when you wake up, your mind wasn't clear because you already have something from the other day. That is going to top up from uh, today and the other day. If you don't meditate again, it's just going to top up more and more and more. And when you meditate, yes, that's why a lot of thought disturbing you because you don't let go, you don't clear out your cash. So that's everyone. Keep practicing. This is the only way. If you want peace, this is how you find it. If you don't do it, no matter where you live, you won't find peace. <laughs> so keep practicing. And I hope to see you again in next Inner Peace 
night time on our upcoming Wednesday. All right, everyone, it's getting late now, and I think it's time. So let's call it a night, and I am broad ending broadcast now. Oh yeah, before we end today, just want to let you know that um, I think it's this Saturday. I will be on a Zoom Saturday Zoom. If you are interested, to come join us, and here is our Zoom session on DMEU. Let me check. Here we go. This. The meeting ID is 8148533 0672 and the passcode is 072. Zoom, Saturday, 7 p.m. Hope to see you there if you can make it. Alright, everyone, have a good night and I see you again next time. Ending broadcast now. <laughs>